four clear signs that you are handling your stick wrongly. Now, as a coach of many years, I've seen a lot of students, a lot of players, and there's enough of data and examples for me to know uh, and identify when I see someone is holding their stick wrongly. And for the first and foremost um, clear example is instead of holding the formal sticks very uh, normally, they hold it the other way around. So they'll be holding this way. Very much like a an oar to, to roll the boat or they'll be literally like handling a broom sweeping the floor. If you do see anyone does that, please just tell them, number one, the top of the shaft you need to go over, the bottom of the shaft you need to go under. All right? So I usually tell them the top is over and under, over and under, and that should do. Now the second sign, it's where their master hand is at the wrong point. So for example, Let's say if this side, this, this hand of mine is my master hand, right? They hold their master hand below the stick, somewhere in the middle, and they start playing like that. Now, this might not happen during normal drills. This would happen naturally when they play in the game. So when they play in the game, they might, they might be holding it correctly initially. Say, like this, for example. And then while chasing the ball, they might chase, and then this would happen. And then they'll start continuing to control the ball for a while. Simply said, they, are, they, are just, short, they just shorten the stick at that moment of time. Okay, when if it's handling one hand, you should be holding at the end of the shaft so that you are utilizing and maximizing the full length of the stick. Right? Third. <coughs> now third would be this. I, I call it an in, inverse L or L shaped like uh, posture. So instead of you know having your shoulders and arms relaxed while playing. Um, when they take shots, okay, they come into this posture. Can you see the L? I hope you can see the L. So L, this inverse L. Okay, this L shaped like posture before they take the shots. Or even when they play, they will play this way. So um, it is very awkward for me to see. when I see this my first and foremost recommendation is they are holding onto the wrong stick side switch it to the other side because there are often um, players who are too used to this and it becomes a habit for them to switch the blade side uh, it becomes too much of hassle uh, in, in their opinion okay so uh, their progress will definitely be limited unless they can uncorrect this habit of theirs Now, fourth um, is a little bit hard to, to detect, but it is possible. Again, it's usually during game time. When they play, they might holding it correctly, this way. Right? Everything looks fine, but in their heat of moment, while they are trying to reach out for the ball, instead of reaching out this way, they reach out this way by switching the hands from bottom to top, and they reach out this way. Why? Because this was or this is their master hand. And once they retrieve the ball and they want to switch it back to two hands, they will do it this way again. They will switch it down and then the other hand 
will then regain back to the top position. So it is super inefficient and again it is a very clear sign they are holding the stick wrongly and the recommendation for this would be switching it to the other side switching the blade side to the other side so that they can uncorrect this habit and it will be a lot more natural to them able to handle the floorboard stick correctly do check out this video over here and i'll check you and i'll see you in the next one and i'll check uh, i'll see you